Scouting cameras are undoubtedly the best way to document all kinds of game coming into your area. Let's hear from Wade on the types of trail cameras he uses. Ease of use is something we all like in any type of a device, whether it's our phones or cars or TVs, and, and technology continues to evolve and adapt and change all the time. And scouting cameras are no different. When I look at the, all the variety of scouting cameras out there, and, and I look at the questions you see on social media, the questions I get emailed or direct message to me on my different uh, platforms and pages, a lot of it is about how do I set up a scouting camera or how do I use it or which one is the best one. And you've got to go through the paces to determine which one works for you. Do you need the best video in the world? Well, maybe this is what you're looking for. Do you just need uh, pictures come into a memory card that you're going to look at on a computer, well then pick one for that. Do you need one with a uh, the ability to adjust the time of day operation, the burst modes? I mean, understanding all those is going to help you pick this specific model that's going to perform for you. But when it comes to the cellular trail camera explosion, right on the back of like the Fusion X, the DS4K, or the reactor, it tells you a lot of the different capabilities. It tells you basically all that you need to know to be able to set this up specifically specifically for you. This QR code makes it so easy to basically, when you open the door on the camera, you take your phone that you're gonna have the uh, have downloaded the app to, you scan that QR code, and you follow the steps, and, and voila, you're all of a sudden gonna start getting content sent to your app and so that you can monitor it, and then from there, you choose the different types of plans that you're wanting to use, which makes it very easy for the end user, which makes it very simple to set up and very, uh, you know, monitorable and financially responsible for you because you can go and get a hundred of these and, and get, you know, pictures. I talked to a buddy of mine the other day, gets $7,000 a year bill on his scouting cameras. He runs over a hundred cameras for his operation in Kansas. That's pretty phenomenal, but the data that he gets, if he had to drive around and check all those over all the counties, he'd, he'd never get to them all. So this gives him real time information. So keep that in mind. These are so easy to set up, whether you're setting up one or a network of a hundred, that app, such as the Stealth Cam Command Pro, is gonna be key in you being able to manage, adjust, and maximize all the data that you're gonna get.